aiming for a different angle on this video. Um, it's discussion. It's drive time. Yes. We're calling it drive time. And today's topic is... Basically, it's not a topic. It's aimed to anyone out there that's thinking about going to get a gym membership and getting down the gym. And we're basically going to give you a few of our our opinions on, on why you should go and do that. And do remember, we're just some average guys that enjoy going to the gym, so we're going to try and impart a bit of our experience on why you should go and get that membership. Mm. So I'm going to, I'll, I'll jump in and then yeah. you, you give them a point after that. My, do you know, my, my shoulder's fatiguing now. Yeah. Okay, so my my first reason for you to, to get your gym membership would be just the, the positive impact that it has on your life in, in general, in terms of your health, it's going to benefit your health, I would have thought, it's going to make you stronger and fitter, maybe you've got a job that that, that need, needs you to be a bit fit, a bit strong, maybe or, you're a, or a job Or a job where you get no exercise whatsoever. Well yeah, there's the flip side, if you're an office worker, you're probably going to want to get your gym membership even more than if you're a, a tradesman, so there's another positive life impact. I'll tell you one thing that Jim did for me when I first started. It's the confidence. Yeah, that's yeah. Just, just the gradual improvement in your body is is equally matched with with the gradual improvement in your confidence. You feel so much better about yourself because even if there's not huge huge difference, you, you feel you're positive. Your body's releasing all these chemicals because you feel good. You're working out. You're sweating. You're improving your your quality of life. You're getting fitter. You, you feel happier. Yeah, exactly. The confidence goes through the roof. Which which leads to my next point, which is there's I definitely think there's a social aspect to it where there's always someone that's gonna to talk to you in the gym. Yeah, yeah, you meet new people. There's always mm. or you, you might you might even meet meet a gym partner, you might you might meet your next girlfriend. It's 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 a very social place. Mm. A lot of the people in there they're gonna ignore you, but some of the people in there are gonna be very friendly and Maybe that's something you need from life. I don't know, but you will find will find that at the gym. Yeah, you get plenty of voice. Help down the gym. And going back to what Andy said, you're because you're building confidence at the same time. It kind of goes hand in hand. So mm. that's very positive. Um, okay, so that's the that's the life, the the life impact on on your career, and everything like that. Also, just to finish up, if you're thinking about joining the gym, then don't join. It's not a think about question. Exactly. Either you want to join, you want to do it, or you don't. Yeah, have a have a solid reason for why you're you're going to be going to the gym. If, if you're thinking about it and you're in this sort of mind and you, you get a membership, you're going to go maybe once a week, once a fortnight. That's just no point. Don't do that. Save everyone else the stress of waiting for the machine when you're taking 20 minutes on it because you don't know how to do it. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the flip side.